Hello and welcome to this use case video for P6 Auditor. P6 Auditor is a tool developed by Emerald Associates that simplifies accessing and reporting P6 audit table data. It employs a user-friendly interface that allows users without the help of their DBAs to sort and filter this data to best fit their needs. In this video, we're going to look at a use case where an activity code is no longer assigned to a project where it had been assigned previously. So we're going to investigate what happened to that activity code. First of all, I'm going to go into P6 where I see I have my project here and it is showing me that um, it does not contain values for this activity code called work order. Now previously this project did have these values assigned to those activities. Now I've gone in and I found that they are missing. So the first thing of course I would want to do is uh, go into my data, into my enterprise data, into my activity codes and I would want to look at my work order and I would want to take a, a look at all the values for that work order. So I can see that yes I do have values in there and it does look like these are the work orders that are missing from my project. So it doesn't make sense that they're not assigned. So I'm going to go into P6 Auditor and I'm going to investigate what happened. Here's the sign-in screen for P6 Auditor. Now, we can actually point P6 Auditor to several different databases. So you are able to choose, if you have more than one database, which database you're actually going to go into. So I'm going to select my production database and I'm going to sign in. Now I want to go to my event reporting. When I open up my event reporting, I'm going to see that I have several topics across the top which are indicating the tables that I have enabled in P6 for auditing. So the first one I want to go to is of course my activity code type. I want to find out what happened with that activity code. So I'm going to click into that tab and um, I'm going to take a look and it looks like we have a lot of things going on here. So first of all, I kind of suspect that my work order code got deleted. So what I can do is I can actually go and I can filter on that column for that operator. So I can click it on, I can take off my check marks and only bring back the deleted uh, pieces of data. So when I apply this and it takes it down, I can now uh, kind of see a little bit better what was going on. And as I, as I scan down, I can see that indeed uh, my work order was deleted because it went from having a value to not having a value. Now, but it's there. So what happened? What happened after that value got deleted? I can go ahead and bring back all of my events now and I saw that this actually happened on the first. So I'm going to just narrow it down and actually I can see the first up here right on the top here. But I can't quite see anything here except for I do see an insert. So I'm going to bring a few more records onto my page. I'm going to look at 50 of them so I can see what happened all on the first. I could also filter by that date if I wanted to. So here I can see here was the deletion of or work order code and then not very long of a time later I can see that it was actually re-added. It looks like whomever was, was doing some deletions uh, may have deleted it by mistake, realized what they did, and recreated it. Now at, at this point I'm probably going to want to get a hold of that user and possibly give them some coaching on what to do when something like that happens because we all make mistakes and we all know that uh, sometimes they're big mistakes. 
Another thing that this is going to allow me to do is go back to the proper date in which I can restore that project and its values for this code type. So I can now tell my DBAs or my IT group what date this occurred on. They can go back and they can recover that information for me if that's possible. So really easy for a user to self-serve their own investigation into what has happened to, let's say in this case, a activity code. So if you would like to get more information on P6 Loader or any of the other tools Emerald Associates provides, as well as any of the services, please feel free to contact us at the numbers shown on your screen, depending on what area of the world you're in. Or you can visit our website for more information. Thank you for joining me for this use case video.